you guys might have known each other before you did this, but you didn't. It seems like we would know each other. We've worked with a lot of the same people. I feel like we never really worked together because we always, it either, either one of us would play that part of the incredibly dashing, <laughs> handsome, young ingenue. I don't know why they're laughing. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> kind of hurts. <laughs> so who came on first? Uh, I did. I looked at this play, and it's like, it's a great play. It's, it's got a, you know, a, a great R, great drama to the play, but really, it's about these two guys. It's about the chemistry between these two guys. And if you don't have that, then it's just, you know, it's just a well-written play. But if you have that chemistry and that dynamic, then it's a well-performed play. It's a, it's a play with, um, you know, spirit and, and soul. And that's why you go to see a play as opposed to reading a play. Is this terrifying for both of you guys, the, the idea of Broadway? Is it a different ballgame? I feel very excited about it. Like I, I was when we when we took it on, I was I was very scared. More not necessarily the performance aspect of it, but the expectations that the play brings with it. Also, I kind of have this image of if I'm I haven't started having anxiety dreams about it yet, but I feel like when I do, it's going to be that I walk out and uh, there's nobody in the audience except one person in the middle, in the front, and it's John Malkovich. <laughs> 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 and I'm just about to open my mouth, and he's just going to stand up and leave. <laughs> <laughs>